I'm Adil Kumar. Welcome to my series on preparing for test. In this video, we'll learn about area of trapezoid and triangle. The question here is, ABCD is an isosceles trapezium. AB equals to 30, CD equals to 20. AB is parallel to CD, right? E is a point on BC where BE to EC, this ratio, is 2 is to 1. What is area ratio of triangle AED to trapezium ABCD? Four choices are given to you. You can pause the video, answer, and then look into my suggestions. Now we can find area of the trapezoid. We can write this as area of trapezoid is basically half of sum of parallel sides, right, which is 20 plus 30 times the height. And we really don't know what the height is. So what we are going to do here is we'll do some construction. So let us extend this side and drop a perpendicular like this. So this is a perpendicular and that gives us the height, correct? So let us say that this particular length from the point, let's say P to Q is X. Rather, we have 2 is to 3, so we'll say let it be 3X, right? That makes sense. So if I assume that PQ, so we are saying let PQ equals to 3x. In that case, since we know that the ratio of BE to EC is 2 is to 1, that is this ratio is 2 is to 1, these two are similar triangles. So we have uh, the side EQ as equal to 2x and PE equals to x does make sense to you right so now we have this distance x that is 2x 1 is to 2 ratio total becomes 3x correct so that is a small construction which will help us to find the solution of this question so we'll multiply this by the height of this trapezoid which is 3x so that becomes area of trapezoid now, we are interested in area of this particular triangle, which is AED. AED means this triangle. Now, what is the area of this triangle? Now, since these two are parallel sides, what we should do is, we should take away the area of the other two triangles from trapezoid to find the area of triangle ADE, right? So that should help us. Okay, so that's what we are going to do. So we are saying that the triangle AED, -E area of this triangle, is equal to area of trapezoid minus area of triangle ABE minus area of triangle DEC. Does make sense to you? Then we get the area of the triangle of our interest. Okay. So that is how we are going to get this area. Now, so this area of trapezoid is half of 50 times 3, right? 20 plus 30 times 3x. That is the area of trapezoid. And from this area, we are going to take away area of these two triangles. Area of triangle is half base into height, right? So we can write this as equal to area of trapezoid is this which is half of 50 times 3x minus area of a 
B and E. Well, B base is this time 30, so half of 30 times height, which is 2x, right? So we had, this height will be 2x minus area of the small triangle, which is half of 20 is the other side length times x, right? So this side will be x. So that becomes the triangle AD area, right? Which you could simplify. So we have uh, x is common factor, right? So x is common, and then we can simplify this term. So what we get here is 25 times 375. So we have 75x minus this is 30x minus this is 10x and that is equal to 75 take away 30 is 45 and then we have 35x correct on the other hand area of trapezoid is 75x this is equal to 50 half is 25 which is 75x correct so now we get the ratio of area of triangle so area of triangle AD over area of trapezoid, let me sketch like this, ABCD is equal to 35x over 75x. So x and x cancel and you can now divide by 5. So when you divide by 5, we get 7 over 15. So that is the ratio. So the answer is C, 7 over 15. So that is the ratio of the area of triangle to that of trapezoid. So I hope that makes sense. Feel free to write your comments, share your views, and if you like and subscribe to my videos, that'd be great. Thanks for your time and all the best.